Hi there, I'm so happy you're here. Welcome back. In today's video, we will be talking about engineering economics. But before we jump into that, I would like to remind all of you with an engineering education from outside of the United States. If you are interested in evaluating your education in this country, I have put together a PDF guide with step-by-step -step instructions on how to do that. Click the link below and you can download it for free. A little note here, some states will allow you to sit for the exam before you can do your evaluation. And some states will ask for this evaluation to be done before you're approved to sit for the exam. It really depends on which state you are in. That being said, let's jump now into our example for today. Let's talk about capitalized cost today. The capitalized cost is the amount of money needed at the beginning of the project to financially support the project's expenses to the infinite life of the project. Usually it is the maintenance cost. Capitalized maintenance cost equals to the annuity over the interest rate, and the capitalized total cost equals to the initial cost plus the annuity over the interest rate. Let's work on an example. What is the capitalized cost of a project that has an initial cost of $50 million and requires annual maintenance cost of $2.5 million? Assume that the effective interest rate is 10%. Let's go to the FE handbook, and I want to show you, you have the formula here for the capitalized cost. You don't have the formula for the total capitalized cost. Just have to remember, when you are asked to calculate the total capitalized cost, you have to add the initial cost to this formula. So capitalized cost equals to initial cost, annuity over interest. So we have $50 million plus... 2,500,000 over interest rate 0 0.1. And this will be equal to the $50 million plus 2.5 million over 0 0.1 equals to $25 million. And this makes the capitalized cost equals to 75 million dollars and the correct answer is a five million that is it for today i hope you found this video helpful if you did don't forget to subscribe and give it a like because this helps put this video in front of more people just like you keep on practicing the fe problems and i will see you next week